today we will be discussing how to resolve the metro bundle issue uh, first i'll demonstrate uh, the issue so when we when we run the react native run android command uh, the metro bundle shows up and then it goes immediately so that's the issue yeah as you can see the metro bundle is open and it's closed immediately so in order to resolve this we have to go to the node modules then we have to find the uh, then metro bundler sorry uh, the metro config folder so run that we go to here yeah. you can go to the metro config folder uh, then we'll go to uh, yeah src default and in that we'll be going to blacklist as you can see from here in this uh, we can see in where shared blacklist variable so here we have to make some changes uh, the only thing is that we have to add a backslash at the starting of uh, this node modules in this bracket and the bracket of react and the bracket of dist so by simply adding these backslashes uh, you can solve this issue now save this file and come to terminal and when we try to run the react native run android now you can see the metro bundler is running so it is now waiting for the application to install into the js server and then it will load from that and it will be uh, redirected to uh, our virtual or uh, the device that you are connected so uh, that's how you uh, resolve this issue so thanks for watching bye bye